So this is the third of our three uh, JavaScript samples integrated into AutoCAD. So let's load <coughs> the drawing that we saw last time when looking at isometric, isom isometric graphics um, or an isometric view of 3D solids. In this case, we're going to go for a full 3D view and we have our three command, which is first going to launch a palette. Now this palette is embedding um, 3.js, a, a, a view of 3.js. Uh, which is which is essentially getting the same data via AutoCAD's JavaScript API from the .NET component that we saw, and this time putting it into a 3D view. Now this is a fairly standard 3D view. I've got a couple of lights set up. One is red, one is green, to give this kind of nice sort of pastel shading. Um, we've got the refresh button as before. If we can we can go across here and and sort of as we saw last time. You know, go ahead and and add a box, add a add a cylinder, which we have, of course will come in as a box as well. Um, and that's really about all there is to it. Um, just as before, we could have had this set up to automatically refresh, but decided to left it leave it as a as a manual operation for now. Uh, we can go ahead and close that and launch the document-based view as well, just as, as, as we saw last time. So this is using the, the trackball capability in 3.js, uh, which allows us to manipula manipulate the view with sort of fairly standard gestures. There's a few keystrokes. I'm just using the trackpad to, to spin it round or zoom in. Um, pretty straightforward stuff. Okay, that's it. Thank you very much.